Happy Monday, boys and girls. Let's get started by reading through our spelling words for this week. The first word is pencil, magnet, publish. The company will publish the magazine. Supper, letter, lady, gravy. What do we eat gravy on? Solo. Solo means all by yourself. You're alone. You are solo. So sometimes seniors sing a solo or you hear a solo um, being sung, which means one person is singing. Open. Odor, which is a smell. Lead. The dog will lead us to where he buried his bone. Touch. Door. Front. And someone. And remember, someone's a compound word. A compound word are two word or two words that put together make one. Some and one. Someone. Let's take a look at some of these words that have kind of our pattern. We're kind of all over the place this week. It's more of a review week for our patterns. So let's take a look. We have napkin, lesson, basket, puppet. Open, human, even, baby. Sunny, frozen, trumpet, pilot. Thread, remember that E-A makes the E eh sound? Thread, O-U makes the A uh sound. Touch, Y makes the I sound. Gym, and myth. Nice job. Now let's read our sentences for the week. Okay, as soon as it comes up. There is an old cotton jacket in the attic. The lady will take a photo of the pony. Nice job, you guys. All right, remember we're going to keep building that fluency as we continue. So let's look at our weekly video. And our essential question. Plant myths and facts. What do myths help us understand about plants? People have told stories to try to explain the world around us. Have you ever heard that finding a four leaf clover will bring you luck? Most clovers have three leaves. It would take luck, or a lot of work, to find one with four leaves. Blowing a dandelion's fluffy seeds into the air won't really make your wish come true. This story helps us understand the life cycle of the dandelion. Blowing the seeds helps dandelions grow in new places. So we're talking about myths this week, and this is plant myths. Our essential question is, what do myths help us understand about plants? So now, what is a myth? Myths are kind of made up stories, okay? They're made up myths. So they're stories that sometimes we believe are true, but they're not. So for example, in the video they said most clovers have three leaves, but sometimes you can find one with four. So some people say finding a four-leaf clover is lucky. Another myth says when you blow on dried dandelion petals, you can make a wish. So as plants grow, they go through different stages, such as seed to plant to flower. So take a look at that picture right there that you see. What do you notice in the picture? Do you know the myth about bluebells? So those are bluebells all across the bottom. It is thought that if you disturb them, something bad will happen. Some myths were created to help us understand how plants develop. Other myths help us understand the stages of a plant's life. Here are, here are a few myths about plants, which we had already talked about a few, the finding the four-leaf clover as being lucky, and when a dandelion dies, you will get a wish when you blow away the seeds. So I want you to think, think about a plant, maybe one you have in your yard, maybe a tulip, maybe a pine tree, I want, or even trees work too. So a pine tree, a maple tree. 
I want you to think about that and create your own myth. Okay, what, what about that makes it special, okay? You can create your own. If you want to share it with me, that'd be great. All right, boys and girls, keep working hard.